Sarah Louise quickly confessed to the killing of Walter Collins in an attempt to protect her son from prosecution. She didn't know that there were several other victims Gordon was suspected of killing. And while Gordon was interrogated separately, he first admitted to killing five boys, but later he insisted he hadn't killed anyone. Sarah Louise also took back her confession, but then later confessed again. It became abundantly clear to investigators that the Northcotts were pathological liars, and they both went to trial separately. Sarah Louise was quickly convicted of killing Walter Collins on December 31st, 1928, and was sentenced to life in prison. Gordon acted withdrawn and strange. He would make several conflicting statements and quickly gave himself away as a pathological liar. And on February 8, 1929, he was found guilty and was later sentenced to death by hanging. When he entered the execution chamber, he cried out to the audience and asked someone to say a prayer for him. And the executioner put the noose around his neck, and within moments they pulled the lever. 